Welcome everyone to this wonderful channel. Today, we're going to tackle a very common issue many of you have been asking about. The problem of view once photos and videos not working on WhatsApp. Ever since I posted my previous two videos showing different methods to open view once media, I've been flooded with messages. Some of you said it worked perfectly, while others said it didn't work at all. So, what's really going on here? Let me quickly explain the two main reasons why this feature might not work for you. Reason number one, your region. The view once feature on WhatsApp hasn't been rolled out equally across all regions yet. That means in some countries, it's still restricted or under testing. If you're in one of those areas, the feature might not function properly, no matter how many tricks you try. The solution? Use a reliable VPN app and switch your location to a region where this feature is fully active and supported. That usually fixes the problem right away. Reason number two, your app version. Always make sure your WhatsApp is fully updated before trying to open or save view once photos or videos. Older versions often block new experimental features, and that alone could be why it's not working for you. Now, in today's video, I'll walk you through two proven methods that are currently working very well, both on Android and iPhone. So stay tuned and make sure you watch till the end. Whether you're using Android or iOS, you've probably faced this frustration. Someone sends you a view once photo or video, you open it once, and then it's gone. You can't reopen it, screenshots are blocked, and screen recordings just show a black screen. But what if I told you there's still a way to keep those photos and videos permanently? Yes, there is. And I'm gonna show you exactly how. Method one, the export chat trick. Here's how to save view once media on WhatsApp without stress. First, open the view once photo or video as you normally would, but don't close the chat yet. Tap on the three dots at the top right corner of your screen. From the drop-down menu, select More, then tap Export Chat. WhatsApp will create a .zip file containing your chat history with that person. You'll be asked which file manager to use for the export. I personally recommend Zarchiver, but any good file manager will do the job. Once the export is done, open the zip file inside your file manager. Tap on it and select Extract, then choose a destination folder. It's better to create a new folder for easy organization. After extraction, open that folder, and there it is. You'll find the same view once photo or video saved permanently on your phone. This method works perfectly for both photos and videos, and it doesn't matter if it's personal, business, or group chat, the media stays stored. Method two, the manage storage method, Android only. Now let's look at another clever way to re-access view once photos on Android. This one uses WhatsApp's own storage system, and surprisingly, it still hasn't been fixed yet. Here's how. Open WhatsApp and tap on the three dots at the top right corner. Select settings, then go to Storage and Data and tap Manage Storage. You'll see a small search icon. Tap it. Now, type the name of the person who sent you the view once photo. For example, if the person is Dr. Williams, search that name. If you've never chatted before, nothing will show, and that's okay. But once they send you a view once photo and you open it, the data is temporarily saved in this section. Now, after opening the view once photo, Go back to Settings, Storage and Data, Manage Storage. Find the chat with that contact, tap their name and scroll down. At the bottom left, tap on the sort icon and choose newest. And there you go. The same view once photo will appear under Media, still viewable and not deleted yet. This trick works because WhatsApp storage system delays the deletion of temporary media files. However, note that this is Android only and could stop working once WhatsApp updates its privacy controls. So use it while it still lasts. Bonus tip, safe capture method. If you want to keep a permanent copy of a view once photo or video, another simple option is to use a screen recorder or screenshot tool right when you open the media. But a word of caution. 
WhatsApp might eventually start notifying senders when you capture view once content, so always be respectful and use this wisely. Remember, privacy matters. If someone trusts you enough to send private media, don't misuse it. These tricks are meant for educational purposes and for saving meaningful moments, not for violating someone's trust. So, what's your take? Do you think WhatsApp should make view once even stricter or allow users to save media for personal use? Share your thoughts in the comments below. I'd love to hear your opinion. And if this video helped you, please give it a like, subscribe to the channel, and tap that bell icon so you never miss another powerful WhatsApp tip. Thanks for watching. Stay smart, stay secure, and keep exploring the tech that makes life easier.